Hi guys, this is Amuz. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can create a basic Aurelia application with ASP.NET Core using the .NET Core CLI. So let's get started. I have my Visual Studio Code open and I can create a new .NET Core application using the CLI with the command .NET New. When you press enter, it shows you all the available templates that's present in your machine. As you can see, you can create um, ASP.NET Core web app, the MVC app using ASP.NET New MVC, or create other apps like um, Angular apps or React.js apps with .NET Core New Angular or .NET Core New React. However, by default, Aurelia does not seem to be present in this list. So if you want to add Aurelia to, the, to this list, I would recommend you go to the website .netnew.azurewebsites.net. Here you can search all the available templates for .NET. Let us search for Aurelia and we get this result ASP.NET Core with Aurelia. If you click that, um, the site provides you with a command line instructions to install um, the Aurelia templates. As you can see, you can use .NET new install Microsoft ASP.NET Core SPA templates to install the Aurelia templates. So let's copy this, go back to our command prompt and paste this. And now it's installing the templates and as you can see now we have ASP.NET Core with Aurelia. So let's create a new Aurelia application using the .NET CLI. Let me clear the screen. So the command is .NET New Aurelia and enter. So it's just scaffolding you with a um, basic Aurelia site. Um, it's using Webpack as the bundler. As you can see, that was very fast. So now we can use npm install to install all the JavaScript dependencies here. Or if you're uh, a fan of Yarn, you can use Yarn as well. So it'll take some minutes to download all the packages here. So let's wait for a while. Just remember while this is installing that um, the .NET new Aurelia command created a ASP.NET Core app with the MVC controller for a um, um, ASP.NET Core backend with um, Aurelia as the front end SPA template. So as you can see on the left here in my um, solution explorer that we have all the app settings, the CS project file, the package JSON for the packages, as well as program.cs and startup.cs that the normal ASP.NET Core uses. It's using um, TypeScript as its um, language. So you have a TS config as well, as well as um, the Webpack config files for um, the app, as well as the <coughs> vendor. Uh, besides that, it created the the ASP.NET Core default WW root folder is available there, and the Aurelia app is inside the client app folder with the boot.ts as its um, main entry point and a sample app with a few components built inside. So we see that the um, installation of package is complete. So to run the app, you just write .NET new .NET run and enter. So what this does is um, it restores all the NuGet packages then it compiles the webpack bundle for on the in the development um, settings and then runs the web server. Now as you can see uh, it's up and running at localhost 5000. Let me just 
copy that open the browser and paste it and go and there you go you have your basic .NET ASP .NET Core Aurelia application ready and provides you with a few points the home, the counter and some page where you're fetching data from an API so that's how you quickly generate your Aurelia basic page to start with your new Aurelia application. Thank you.